So for today, we're going to be doing something a little different. I'm going to be playing actually a game from my childhood called Tasmania. Now, I was never big into Looney Tunes, even in my childhood. And I don't have that much nostalgia for a lot of these quote-unquote kitty games. But... This is a bit of an exception, and he, I honestly barely didn't even notice that it is a Looney Tunes thing. Because I didn't, again, I didn't watch this as a kid, apart from the Roadrunner. So, take it as you will, but... I, this is just one of those rare times where... I don't know if it's nostalgia or it's just that good of a game, but take it as you will. Oh, I meant to change that difficulty. Oh, I guess... Well, I know practice is the quote-unquote easy mode, but I guess there's no normal, so I, we'll just stick with easy because there's a couple levels late game that are kind of BS. But... Anyways, as I was saying, this is, as a Genesis kid, I didn't even know that there, uh, there was one on the SNES, and that one apparently was completely different. I did watch a bit of it, and it did not look very good, so if you're going to play Tasmania 1, get the Genesis version. I don't even know, honestly, know who these other characters are. That's how little I know about the IP. I just know that it's a fun game. <laughs> I honestly don't even know what that's supposed to be, but it does give a fire power up. As seen. Ooh, I messed up. I'm gonna have to restart this, because I screwed up. That's not the control settings I wanted. Let me just... And as you can tell, I'm playing this on RetroArch. The core is Pico Drive. Let me just fix this. There we go. I think that's right. A professional YouTuber, quote unquote, or one of those tryhards would probably edit what I just did out, but I'm not the type to do that. This is raw footage, this is me screwing up. I'm not trying to be like one of those, oh, look how good I am types. And this first stage in the desert is pretty much the weirdest in the whole game, because what the heck are these things supposed to be, and why do they make that weird sound? Like, listen to that. What is that supposed to be? Some of these enemies you can actually eat, but that's generally not a good idea because it causes damage. Just use the flamethrower. Don't know how many shots you get with it, or I don't remember. Not a whole lot of those power in the game, if I remember right. And I know this first stage can be a bit of a death trap. See if I can get through it without dying. Couldn't do it. 
This freaking water spouts are a pain in the ass to jump on, and these are the only ones that will kill you just by standing on them. I'm gonna do this one very freaking slowly. I'm off to a great start. Death traps are gone, but this stage is tedious in its own way, and I know that rock at the top is going to be a bastard if I don't lure it. Yeah, this, the desert stage is, while plenty freaking weird, is not particularly fun to play, but if you pass the first two, it gets better. Yeah, those are not cherries, those are bombs. Do not eat those if you don't have an invincibility power-up or invincibility frames going on. Just don't. As you can see, that guy's a bastard.
Like I said, don't eat the bombs, and of course I gotta do the whole thing over. Yeah, notice that the frame rate just jumped. Also, I do not know what the hell those two are supposed to be. Guessing they're in the cartoon, but who knows.
shot to a tank factory, but okay. secret. You actually can kill that one if you're quick enough. 
Pretty sure if you get the life before the checkpoint, it won't respawn. Apart from maybe the final, most bosses in this game are piss easy.
Ah uh, yes, the death machine level. This should be interesting. Let's see if I remember where everything is. freaking sucked. No, I do not remember where everything is. really thought I would die more than that. But if I didn't this one, I will- that last one, I will in this one because this level SUCKS! This, is, this level is the leap of faith in the game and later. Like, it's gonna get bad. soft lock myself. Yep, I did. I can't reset it either, and I can't wait for a timeout. <sighs> and unfortunately, I have hardcore mode on, so I can't rewind. I'll end it here and try again another time. I say as soon as I get through it. Yeah, don't go down there.
quite amazed I made that jump on the first try. I died so many times there as a kid. Yeah, leave of faith. forgot about that jump. That one also killed me a shit ton of times. <sighs> I have with only two lives left. I don't know if I'm going to make it now. Because that jump is honestly worse than the last one. And of course they didn't put a checkpoint at the top of that stupid... This level sucks. Like this in the second desert level just oh. two very blatant turns on this other one. It's a fairly decent game. Alright, let's see if I can not screw this up. Calm your tits. See if I can. Oh, I made it. Oh, if I just not die to these funny things. Oh, that was way too close. I thought I was gonna die there.
level is really confusing. Yes, the death trap, and of course I had to hit it on my last life.
Why they essentially chose to more or less copy and paste the level, but okay, I believe this is the final one. Might take me a few attempts because I think this is the one boss that's actually a bit of a challenge. But then again, maybe it's because I'm playing on no, I'm not playing on hard mode, which I'm not going to do because I'm not going to do with that on the mines level. Though that that just sucks. That's a lot of work to go through just for a chicken or a seagull chicken. I don't know. But then again, what the price of eggs are these days? Yeah. But anyways, that's Tasmania. Really could have used a few extra levels, especially since it's not particularly challenging apart from a couple of difficulty spikes like the mines. May or may not do the Martian one, which is kind of a sequel to this. It's not very good, but who knows. Also, there is a Game Gear version. It's not quite the same, but it's kind of is, but either way, it sucks. Don't play it. <laughs> 